Hello, it's December 5th. It's winter outside and there's lots of snow on the ground, below zero, obviously. And here I am going to cut some fresh broccoli that I'm growing in my basement. This has been, this was planted around October 1st, so it's about 60 days or so. And it's ready. As you can see, the leaves are quite large. Like it's a very, very big leaf. And there's actually three plants in here, but you'll see the one plant right away has a very large stem. And uh, it grew over the other ones. So after I cut this one, hopefully uh, the other ones will get enough light so that they can uh, grow too. I think I need a chainsaw to cut through the stem. I've never actually cut broccoli before. And this is my first time ever growing it. I have never grown it outdoors. And hydroponically, it responded very well with the UFO 90 watt LED lights. Okay, ready. This is the broccoli I just cut in my grow room and as you can see it's about two and a half feet wide and I'm very very impressed with the uh, how the LED lights that were only 90 watts uh, grew this entire broccoli like it's it's huge. Um, I didn't think it would actually grow uh, the flower or, or the head part of the broccoli. It was very impressive. Another really cool thing is having broccoli available in the winter. Um, can't wait to eat this tomorrow. It's uh, minus. It's going to be about minus 17 degrees Celsius this week, and I get to eat nicely, fresh, the grown broccoli in in my home. I wouldn't grow this again in my grow room just because of the size of it. It kind of took up a lot of space. Um, if I had more room, I definitely would grow this. Again, um, I look forward to growing this outdoors or in a greenhouse, um, or if I can expand my grow room into my wife's um, scrapbooking room. Yeah, I don't think she'll like that. <laughs> Cut. <laughs> this is the stem, and uh, the stem was very thick. It was very hard to cut through. Uh, I used a serrated knife that was actually a very sharp, uh, good quality knife, and it's, uh, it's almost like a tree stem. So like it almost needs a hacksaw or perhaps a power saw, but that's uh, just my broccoli project. I'm very impressed with it.